Alright guys, what is going on? It is Will here, playing some more Modern Warfare 3 on the map Underground. So today I have a commentary for you, and today's commentary is on the topic of subscribers, and why the freaking hell are so many people losing them? Lately, many of the larger channels like Machinima, Charlie is so cool like, and even Ray William Johnson, but also many more, have been losing subscribers. This doesn't mean like they're using, losing one or two, like, oh hello, I've got an average channel. I have 500 subscribers, and oh no, I lost one today. Oh, that's funny, because the other day I lost 5 subscribers. No, 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 back up a bit. Machinima, Charlie is so cool, like, they're losing hundreds, and even thousands. For example, Machinima lost 37,000 subscribers in one day. I know what you're thinking, guys, that is freaking insane. Every channel you look on on Social Blades, you know, the website, I just browse through and be like, mm, I'm looking through my channel at like about, and it's not doing too well. And then I'll just be like, mm, let's get a look at Machinima. Look through Machinima, yeah, oh wow, a million views in a day. Scroll down, oh my fucking god, they've lost 37,000 subscribers in one day. Oh my god! Yeah, that's what it's like, guys. That is what it's like for me, because I'm still trying to get over it now. And I do want to get down to the bottom of this. So, I'm going to tell you what I think now, guys. Or put... Put, 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 put forward some opinions on why I think these channels are losing subscribers. But please be advised, guys. This is my own opinion, so please don't take my word for it. And I am not doing this to offend any of the channels. I'm just going to put forward on what I think. So let's head into it. A reason why I think they could be losing so many subscribers is because people are getting bored of their content. For example, they, load, they upload like two videos a day and every single day. And for some people, they could have been following them for like three years, maybe. And it's come to the time when they're like, do you know what? I'm getting a bit bored of Machinima now. I mean, their content's good, don't get me wrong. But it's the same, it's repetitive. I've seen enough, so I'm just going to unsubscribe them. And that could be the case, guys, because obviously, if you've been watching someone's content for three years, it will get a bit repetitive after time. And some people may get bored, it's natural. So I guess that could be a reason why people are unsubscribing. But don't get me wrong, Machine was an amazing network and they, you know, upload amazing content. But if you've been watching them religiously for three years, I can see why people get bored. And I could see why people want, you know, want to look for another network or want to look for another channel because they want something fresh, they want something new. They want to find the next bee's knees. Which you never know, it could be me. Now joking guys, joking. Uh another reason why people could be losing subscribers it's because they're looking to get their like subscriber ratio better what do I mean by this you may ask well you know on Twitter you get people like oh, hello my name's Jonathan and I've got a hundred followers on Twitter oh but wait I'm following a hundred people that must mean I've been doing follow for follow well that doesn't look good on my Twitter does it wait there and I'll go I'm following some people, so maybe if I'm following like 10 people, it will make me look like a boss, yeah. So this is, what this is what I think people could be doing on YouTube as well. For example, they could be looking at their subscription base, and they're thinking, yeah, I've got a thousand subscribers, but I'm also following, I'm also, going to say Twitter then, no, we're not on Twitter. They could be subscribed to, let's say, 900 people. So they could be looking for their subscription base and thinking, Damn, I need to lose some subscribers because it's, isn't, it's not looking as better as it could. So they could be going through and they could be seeing, you know, Machinima, Ray William Johnson be like, Do you know what? I don't really care no more because they've got a thousand, they've got millions of subs. And I guess it won't hurt if I lose one, if they lose one. So obviously they unsub. And this, is, this could be like a chain reaction, I think. This could be like what most people are looking for. Just to... Um, I keep I keep thinking Twitter, but it's not Twitter. They could be looking to unsub these big channels because they want to get you know their subscription base better, which in a way is fair enough. But obviously, it's catching on to Machinima and other co uh, and other companies. I'm not just singling out Machinima, but this could be another reason why they're losing subscribers. I could also think due to Machinima being exposed recently for for many reasons. For example, Hutch is left, doesn't he? Um, I reckon, due to Hutch leaving, people may think that Machinima isn't there no more. They may think that Machinima is losing that sparkle that Hutch brand. So I believe they could be uns unsubscribing because of that reason. 
However, that doesn't justify why people are unsubscribing from Charlie, Charlie, and everyone. So I'm not sure at the end of the guys gate. No, I'm not sure at the end of the day, guys. I can't even get my words out. Now, I honestly do not know the reason behind this, guys. I just this is just some thoughts I put together. I'm trying to put two plus two equals four, but in my re in my case, it could be equal in five. You never know, guys. Uh, just again, I'm never uh, disrespecting any of channels. But if you do know the reason why or want to put an idea forward, please, please leave a comment, guys, because it really does help me and it really will help us get to the bottom of this because I'm an eager beaver and I do want to find out why people are losing subscribers. So this really is going to help me, guys, if you do leave a comment because I love you all and I love it when you leave comments. And if you do leave a comment, I promise I will get back to all of you because I will soldier through it, guys. I will soldier through it. So, anyway, as we have a little bit of time left, we are playing some underground. And if you haven't noticed on this commentary, I've been picking up quite a few guns. Uh, this means, like, I've been running around like a bouse trying to pick off kills. And there'll be gun on the floor, and I'll just pick it up and just start using it. And that's tending to come into my gameplay recently. Like, not just this gameplay, but even when I'm playing, like, not trying to get a commentary. I'll just walk around picking up guns and testing them out which if I'm gonna be honest with you guys it's a good idea because then you for example how I'm gonna put this if I use an M4A1 all the time it's gonna get boring and it's gonna get repetitive so by me running around picking up other guns I can find another gun that would be perfect for me it's all about looking around for it guys because I honestly thought I'd be using the M4A1 for my whole Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. <coughs> Sorry guys, yeah. I thought I'd be using it for my whole Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. But since I've been running around and picking up guns, I must have found at least six other guns now that I can use and get decent commentary with. So it's just really surprising on how much you can learn from Modern Warfare 3 if you go around picking up other guns because it really does help your gameplay guys so I really would advise that especially if you're bored just testing out other guns because it really does help so anyway guys this brings us nicely to the end of the commentary uh, we won 7500, 500, 600 here is my friend Goldie who I was playing with picking up the game winning kill oh yes to that spray mmm tasty so anyway guys my score is 29 and 8 thanks for watching I'll see